Perfect cool. Perfect weather outside today, Craig. It's so true. <laughs> the sunshine, the 60s, boy, I just can't get enough of it. <laughs> the mountain is out. Some pictures are coming in. Uh, Nat Heather photo sent this. Uh, you can use the hashtag K5Spring. Share your pictures with us or text them to us. 206-448. 4545 four, five. and here's one more. I like this one. The bleeding heart. Mark and Laura, I love this book. Is that gorgeous? I actually discovered we have one in our yard. I was so happy. So I saw this picture. I'm like, I gotta show this one as well. So today we got into the mid 60s. We have some low 60s right now, a couple of upper 50s as well. The reason being is the sea breeze is starting to pick up. We talked about this yesterday and some of those uh, sustained winds are 10 to 15 miles per hour. Some of the gusts getting up to 20. Now for the next two hours, especially along the coast, South Puget Sound, uh, right along Port Angeles to Squim, uh, you've got some gusty winds at times this evening, the 20 to 30 mile per hour gusts. That's 9 p.m. still coming in out of the west northwest. 33 Oak Harbor by midnight, so overnight tonight you may hear the wind howling. Uh, we don't have any watches, warnings, or advisories as far as wind is concerned, but I wanted to show this to you because it is the major player in our weather for the next 24 hours as far as cooling us off a little bit more, giving us some cloud cover tomorrow morning. That's 8 Thursday evening. After that, the wind starts to shift direction. Now, this is the main player right now, this low pressure giving us that clockwise or counterclockwise rotation and the wind in place. Into the weekend, high pressure starts to build in. We don't have any rain in the forecast for the next seven days. And with that in place, boy, a beautiful day for opening day on Saturday. So lots of sunshine for you. 8 o'clock in the morning, 52 degrees, partly cloudy. By 11 o'clock, mostly sunny, and we're closer to 70 degrees by 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Overnight tonight, you've got some 40s, low 40s at that to start your Thursday morning highs. Tomorrow are back into the upper 50s and low 60s. Very similar to what we did today before we start to inch those numbers up into Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. We'll get to about 62 in Linwood tomorrow. Bremerton 61, uh, Redmond 65, a couple of mid 60s for uh, South Puget Sound. Hey, how about Federal Way 64 for you? That's kind of nice as well for your Thursday afternoon. And right along the coast, you've got more in the way of those 50s, and these are going to be mid 50s at that. A little windy at times tomorrow morning. We will start off with some clouds cover. You will get the sunshine by the afternoon and then after that we'll continue to enjoy a very nice finish to the week. Uh, temperatures for eastern Washington closer to 70 in some of the warmer spots. Here's your seven day forecast 63 tomorrow. 67 on Friday. Look how quickly we jump back up to the 70s on Saturday and Sunday and then into Monday. We'll continue with those upper 60s. But boy, the weekend sure does look fantastic. Enjoy it.